What was that sound? Child, I'm out here like exposing myself for free as well. <laughs> Pretty young girl from Zambia. You know that she ain't with the drama. Light skin girl Osama. You know she the bomb, she cause trauma. Hey guys, welcome back to welcome to my channel. Hi, my name is Nyamba and I create YouTube content which you should subscribe to. Okay, so welcome to the first vlog of 2022. I actually just clocked that like today. I was like, I actually haven't like vlogged this year. So I'm excited because I will be vlogging a day in my life as you can tell from the title. So yeah, I hope you guys like it. I will just get ready and do what I gotta do. I'm staying indoors today. So enjoy. Don't forget to thumbs it up, share somebody and of course subscribe. Okay, so I'm a bit conflicted right now because I want to play music while I get ready and stuff. But then I also want to talk to the camera so it's like mm, okay so i'll basically give you guys like a rundown of what i thought my day was gonna look like today and then i'll probably like speed through just me putting makeup on and whatnot but today i planned on going into town to like a coffee shop to do what i gotta do just like chill have a coffee you know what people do in coffee shops and stuff but chow it's snow outside i was like ain't no way i'm going out in this weather <laughs> So, plans done changed. I'm still gonna get ready, look decent enough. Gonna change out of this robe, <laughs> obviously. I had like a bath earlier, just soaked myself and it was so nice. Yeah, look decent to stay home, basically. I need to do a digital declutter. Been meaning to do this for so long. I just need to declutter like my laptop, my phone. Yeah, and within my phone, like my camera roll, my notes, apps, like all that. So I'll explain more later, but yeah, I was hoping to do all that from the coffee shop but uh, mm -hmm, no <laughs> well i'm not sure right now if i want to do my face or my hair first but i think we can do hair first if i accidentally flash you guys i'm sorry child this robe is not doing it's not understanding the assignment <laughs> i'm just gonna use my mousse on the wig to just give it some life even though I'm not going anywhere as I said it just needs some life now I'm thinking I should probably put this on my head first to then try to do this cuz I'm gonna be a mess hold on one minute 37 seconds later this Nyambiana in the building now <laughs> You guys, I recently started wearing this wig to work, right? And the compliments I've gotten, they're all like, oh my god, your hair is so nice, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, thank you. I just go with it because it is too much work to start explaining that this is not my hair and it's a wig. So as far as Karen at work is concerned, this is my hair and I dyed it and did all of that. <laughs> I was actually laughing with Musha last night. I was telling her about how this guy at work was like, oh my God, your hair is stunning, like this and that. I'm like, I guess I dub where the day they find me in the locker room is ninja fool. <laughs> And as at now, none of them know I do YouTube. So the day they find out, they'll be like, oh my God, she's such a fraud. <laughs> this whole time it wasn't her hair. And I'll be like, yep. Yeah. Also, I'm not gonna do my edges because I'm giving them a break from gel. All I've been doing is putting my hair in gel ponytails, like sleek ponytails and puffs. So yeah, I'm giving it a break. Okay, so for makeup, I was gonna do like a proper beat, like I was gonna put foundation on and stuff. But now I'm looking like it's already 3 p.m. Fair enough, the sun's not going down for another couple hours, so like I'll get to, you know, look cute for a minute. But I think I'm just gonna prime, conceal, do my brows and everything else. Basically, I'm not putting foundation on, so yeah. I say, Kiki, are you with me? Are you down when it's getting windy? Do you promise to never leave me? When they lie, we still believe me. I say, If you give your heart to me, I'm not gonna let you go. I'm not gonna do you, but I'm a baby, trust in me. Jada, are you with me? Are you down when it's getting windy? Also, 
today my eyeshadow is the natural pigmentation of my eyelids so i am not putting anything on them and yeah natural eyeshadow today for bronzer i'm going back to my old faithful which is this the fenty beauty sun stalker bronzer in coco naughty it's just like a really subtle bronze and it's nothing too dramatic yeah don't want no good girl i need a free free and she know i'm gonna take a portrait from paris straight to bali i'm balling i'm really balling the money calling is really calling the money calling is really calling and i and i never ever put that shit on hold and i'm really in this dress i need to go money don't make me i make money my thing tastes like chicken curry go low go low no 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 go low okay so if you watched my last video which was romanticizing my life i talked about how one of my favorite quotes is to like stop waiting for the special occasion because being alive is a special occasion so today because being alive is a special occasion i'm about to spray some of my favorite perfume ever this is justin bieber's someday you guys i've repurchased this perfume like twice i think it's so nice and every time i have it on i literally get complimented from like the most random people so today i'm about to spritz some on myself Ooh, oh my gosh i haven't sprayed it in so long i forgot how amazing it smells child i smell edible right now purr <laughs> I'm also adding some of my Primark body mist. I practically use this one on a daily basis because duh, it's from Primark. Like I can just repurchase it without thinking twice. <laughs> Guys, look at how British weather is set up. So after it snows like mad, now the sun is out. Like, are you joking? Like, am I actually a joke to you? Maybe I am. <laughs> okay, so I just spent a bunch of time taking some photos because I was like, oh, I kind of look decent. The fact that I didn't like fully beat my face, I was like, I don't know if I'm gonna look ready enough for photos, but they actually turned out pretty all right. Now I'm gonna have to go through all of them, which is gonna be a hassle, but who is she? She's so cute, period. <laughs> and now before I get to work, I need to have something to eat. And that's what I need to do because child, we not finna starve, we not finna faint. So let's get us some food. Who has lunch at almost 4 p.m.? Not even almost 4 p.m., past 4 p.m. I do, okay? So for lunch, I'm thinking mac and cheese. I bought this yesterday. Just figured I would try it out. I'm trying to, you know, broaden what I eat. Like I always get stuck in the cycle of eating like the same stuff over and over again just because it's like my safe haven. Like I know it's not gonna disappoint me and I like it. So this time I was like, okay, let me try something different. So usually like I'll just have like noodles with baked beans and mayonnaise and stuff because that's my safe haven. Like that's what I like to eat for lunch. But then this time I was like, let me try something different. So we're gonna try to make this mac and cheese and we finna make a salad, okay? According to the date on this, it expired two days ago, but honestly, it doesn't look that bad. Like, it's definitely not gone bad. It's just not as fresh, you know? So, yeah. I also have here some feta cheese. They are cubes, obviously feta cubes. Cucumber, salad tomatoes, and some honey and mustard dressing to go with it. I'm gonna make the salad first and then do the mac and cheese because it's the first time I'm making it like from the packet, I wanna actually follow the instructions. So salad first and then that.
So according to this here packet, I'm gonna need milk and water and it has like specific, why do I feel so zoomed in? Anyway, it has like specific measurements. So I'm actually getting the measure cup out, girl, because we're not about to mess this up. The ancestors don't work when it comes to mac and cheese. They work for like spices, not freaking mac and cheese. So we're following the instructions to a T. So this here mac and cheese is taking way longer than it should. It says it's meant to be ready in eight minutes. It's been eight minutes and I'm hungry. I had to add more water because that water was not enough and it just started sticking to the bottom. And I might have to add yet a bit more. Let me taste, the one I tasted earlier was literally still hard. Oh, it's hot. Okay, it's all fit now. Say hi to the vlog. Oh, hi, vlog. <laughs> hey, hey, I made it, gang, gang. Wow. <laughs> I made myself some mac and cheese. Like, but crap or like actual? No, not from scratch. Uh, I ain't got that type of energy. <laughs> I even made a salad, like, who am I? Who is she? So fat. What was I gonna say? Oh, I'm home alone for the week. That's great. The whole week? Yep. It's actually not terrible. Okay, so it is literally past 6 p.m. now. A bunch of time has gone by just because I was on the phone with Kay for a while, spoke to my mom, and then did the dishes, all of that, adulting. But now, I'm finally doing what I really set my mind on to do today, which is do the digital declutter. So, I have my devices right here. I got my phone, got my iPad, got my MacBook, and my hard drive, so let's Let's just let's just do it I think we're gonna start with emails because those are the things that I'm just like can never be bothered with honestly and truly it's just a pain in the backside and right now both my main email boxes that's my Yahoo and my Gmail have like over 300 unread messages in them so we have to go through those majority of them are probably just like not spam but things i'm subscribed to like coupons just freaking plt telling me something's on sale you know stuff like that basically promo emails that's what i'm getting at so we have 409 emails in my yahoo and 366 in my gmail i'm just gonna fast forward this bit but from what i can see like i just signed up to goodreads like yesterday i want to say or the day before i think yesterday so it's just sent me notifications of like people sending friend requests or me accepting the request so it's like oh you're now friends with so and so i see linkedin a lot i see justin bieber a lot i see my uni telling me to complete my registration for graduation which i need to do i've just been procrastinating on my internship place yeah, just a bunch of stuff. I'm gonna start by deleting things. Oh, I see a ZRA one. Tax return and payment due date notification. Oh my God, adulting. <laughs> I'm gonna start by deleting a bunch of them and then I'll start opening them later, but deleting is like what I must do. So let's go. Wish me luck. <laughs> This inbox has emails from 2019 and 2020 that I haven't opened and am I embarrassed? It's up for discussion. Hello? 
No, I was like, not my mom calling me. <laughs> Hi, sis. Guys, I just found an email from someone who was like asking something actually valuable from September 2021, and I'm actually gonna reply to it. Um, ciao. Anyway, so. <laughs> Like I feel bad just letting it be but like I genuinely had not seen it. So now that I've seen it I might as well reply to it in it <laughs> Another thing I've decided to do is, why is my head so big? <laughs> is change the frequency of some of the emails that I receive from like LinkedIn. So I have my job alerts on, seven of them coming daily, which is just a bit overwhelming. I am changing them to the weekly preference, to the weekly frequency, because that way it's like, I just won't have as many, they'll be combined. <laughs> So I'm taking a break from my Yahoo inbox because I've just had enough. I've been dreading this for a reason. It's not fun. Like there's literally nothing fun about it. But I've had some Yo Maps playing in the background to, you know, boost me up. So now I'm moving on to my Gmail because here it's mostly just junk. There's like Uber Eats, freaking Uber itself, Ulendo, which is the Zambian Uber, stuff from Indeed, like... At this point, I need an Olendo sponsor because, ciao, look at this. Like, these are all receipts that I haven't deleted. Time check. It is 8.40 p.m. And I have managed to bring my Google, my Gmail, <laughs> down to 42 in my inbox from 300 and whatever it was, ciao, what the hell. Whew. This is exhausting. This is why I don't do it. Like, I haven't even gone through my phone and my iPad yet. I'm tired. It's 20 past 9 p.m. right now, and you know what time it is? It is time to make some dinner. This is normal for me when I have no one to feed, basically. Well, no one to feed besides myself, because it's like my timing is just according to my schedule, pretty much. So, for dinner, I'm thinking I got some mozzarella sticks yesterday. I was hoping there were fries, but they're none. So, I'll just put those in the oven. We'll just have mozzarella sticks with the rest of the salad that I made earlier, cause, let me show you. There's still like this much left, which is a decent amount to make me full. So yeah, I'll just put some mozzarella sticks in the oven and then we shall eat. <laughs> just bachelorette meals. Bone at the teeth. Okay, so I have eaten, done the dishes, and sliced bananas to freeze that I'm gonna use in like smoothies and stuff because they weren't really going off, they were ripening and I knew I wasn't gonna eat them quick enough so yeah, just sliced them up, put them in the freezer and now I'm gonna, I guess just chill for a minute, catch my breath, you know, all that. I only have like one major thing to do on my to-do list for now. I wanna make like a real version of my romanticized video in case you didn't watch that you should it's cute and I put in lots of editing hours <laughs> to make it all nice and aesthetic and stuff so yeah and then I'm just gonna do my night routine basically take my makeup off read journal do all that eventually change into PJs 
ends and yeah this hair i keep forgetting to fix it <laughs> whatever in terms of the vlog i will call it a night thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed it don't forget to thumbs it up share it with somebody and of course subscribe i'll see you guys next time bye